Let's move on to let me move on to something a little more positive, man. How you feeling about All your right. boy Cliff Huxtable, man? <laughs> <laughs> oh man. I don't even I don't even know where to start, man. It's like if 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 you came to Bill Cosby, this is the way I look at it. If it's the year nineteen seventy seven and Bill Cosby <laughs> invites you to his hotel room, you know good and well you ain't about to get no pudding pops. Listen, man, that man was putting Molly all in that jello, man. <laughs> no. I'm like, you know, goodness well, he invites you to the hotel room. You know, he, you're not about to sit down and, and read for a role on the Cosby Show. <laughs> Listen, man, when they you already knew what it was when they Look, all I got to say, my man James Evans ain't never do none of that, man. That's why I rock <laughs> with my man. <laughs> He ain't never do that. He ain't never hear about uh, Jimmy Walton <laughs> putting Miley in nobody jello, man. Um, I don't All know. I know is Webster. Webster ain't never do that to nobody. <laughs> you know, that <laughs> nigga, Gary Coleman, that <laughs> nigga, uh, Arnold. Arnold ain't do that to nobody, neither did Mr. Drummond, man. Oh, yeah, the nigga at the bike can... shop, <laughs> that's a whole different story. <laughs> If you came back to the hotel, man, you already know what it was. Don't, don't act like you didn't come there. I think those women thought he was going to put them on, like put them on the show or put them in. Because, you know, he had a bunch of different shows at that time, too. So they probably thought he was going to yeah. put them on in the Hollywood. And he was like, nah, I got what I wanted. You can get out. Like, I mean, keep it genuine, though. Like, do you think that uh, Fat Albert was raping women? <laughs> I have no comment. I I wasn't there. Like I said, I think those women knew what it was. They didn't get what they wanted out the deal. Now I don't know if he used drugs or not to get it popping. I don't know. I wasn't there. Look, I mean, I look at it. You know, it's like all right, one or two women. You might be like, nah, these just some random thoughts trying to get some money about them. But it's like fifteen different women, man. <laughs> Yeah, I think there, there there is some fire where the smoke is, but I was not there. I don't know what Bill Cosby was doing with his money, but we heard other people do. You know, even like, we had a president that was even, you know, had women on the side. So it's not. I'm not even surprised, really. Yeah, like I, that's what I think it more was. I think he was a tricking money off uh, because it was like a dude that he worked with at NBC. He basically was saying that Bill basically was doing his thing with his side pieces. And he would pay him money off, and I got—I don't know. Maybe the payments must have stopped coming through. You know, really, the real win out of this is, is, is the dude Hannibal Burris, man. Because I ain't never heard <laughs> of the dude until this. So. I heard of some of his stuff. He, I mean, he he does like that real dry comedy where he just tells stories and like kind of pauses and makes you think about the irony. But he's not like that fall on the ground funny. Nah, not to me. But yeah, he is definitely winning right now. Yeah. Let's see. Was anything else I wanted to say about Cliff? Uh, I don't know. Like that was just. I don't know. That was just kind of crazy. Like uh, they canceled all the shows. They uh, his uh, NBC special. They took the reruns off. They ain't showing Fat Albert no more. They um. <laughs> they didn't got rid no of uh, Kids Day the Darnest Things. <laughs> <laughs> and it took that go I spy off of, um off of T V land. Uh no more little Bill. And Bill Cosby sweaters they half off at Marshalls now. Like it, it was crazy, <laughs> man. <laughs> 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 